I forgot to loot Frank Horgan. I'll never have another chance. That's awkward. This cutscene has definitely made him an infancy of 3D graphics. Well, I said we'd be able to beat Fallout 2 tonight, and I didn't lie. Fortunately, now the ending video has this awful double image effect, but... Hopefully I can edit that for the YouTube part. After the Enclave's destruction, the refugees of Arroyo and Vault 13 resettled, building a new community with the aid of the Garden of Eden Creation Kit. Finding themselves hundreds of miles from their vault, the members of Vault 13 chose to join the villagers in establishing a new community, and their technical expertise, combined with the villagers' survival skills, allowed the new settlement to grow and prosper. Two generations of the same bloodline were reunited, and their savior, the Chosen One, became Elder, presiding over the village in the years to come. Relations between the Slags and the residents of Modoc flourished. Between the two peoples, Modoc prospered and became a major farming community, supplying all the outlying regions with food. With Metzger gone, slavery disappeared Ooh, from the Ooh, that's us. Becky's casino bar grew quickly, and Rebecca Dyer's reputation as an honest casino and bar owner brought her the business needed to buy out her competition and expand. The den flourished, and it soon gained a reputation for being a tough but honest community. Okay. In the years to come, Vault City suffered greatly from raider attacks. Eventually, the situation grew so desperate, the citizens were forced to request aid from NCR. Within a month, a large detachment of the NCR's military was stationed in Vault City. The military presence quickly became an occupation force, and Vault City became the first of NCR's border territories. The Mordino family grew greatly in power as Jet's influence spread across Northern California. Within a year, they had seized control of New Reno and expanded their empire, absorbing the den and other surrounding areas. There was little violence in the conquest, as Jet had weakened all resistance to Mordino rule. Myron died less than a year after the defeat of the Who? Enclave, stabbed by a Jet addict while drinking in the den. His discovery of Jet was quickly forgotten, and now there is no one who remembers his name. We, we never spoke to that person. Optimizing Gecko's reactor created a power surplus in Gecko. The Vault City Council unable to expand because of their limited power supply, yielded to internal pressure and was forced to take over Gecko to control the reactor. The peaceful ghouls of Gecko became slaves and spent the rest of their lives serving Vault City. But Vault City got taken over by the NCR. After Doc Johnson helped treat the miners during the Great Jet Scare, the citizens of Vault City voted Doc Johnson into the mayor's seat. Under the doctor's patient hand, Redding forged closer ties with Vault City until, some years later, Vault City annexed Redding, granting Vault City citizenship to only 10% of Redding's population. Shortly after your last departure, the powder keg of racial tension in Broken Hills exploded. Oh, oops. Racist humans fought against mutants, ghouls, and humans who sided with the mutants. The few survivors of the battle destroyed the mine ensuring no one else could profit by it, and disappeared Ooh. into the wastes. Fucked up that town. Your help with Vault 15 launched the New California Republic's push to civilize its neighbors. Though there were many more obstacles to overcome, the NCR now had a foothold into the northern wastes. With the support of the New California Republic, the Vault 15 squatters soon became self-sufficient and productive members of society. Huh. By eliminating the death claws of Vault 13, you banished yet another species of the realms of extinction, proving once again that genocide is a viable solution I... to any problem. What? I had Goris. The she flourished, creating a botanical scourge on the radiation surrounding their beloved town. 
Though this vine could not grow in other soils, the Shi took care to nourish it in their lands. They continued to grow in strength and prominence, forming the basis of a new empire. Ooh. As for the tanker vagrants, well, as vagrants do, they drifted on. Okay. Blake doomed a couple towns there. There is some weird continuity. It's like Vault City took over Gecko, but then NCO took over Vault City, but then Vault City took over Redding. Things didn't really work out unless you were from Blake's town, I think. I don't think anybody did well. I guess the people in Redding don't do jet anymore. San Francisco did great. San Francisco's the place to be. Well, a bunch of people made Fallout, whatever. Do we have to continue playing? Yes. Because there's one last thing I want to show before we end the stream and end the adventures of Blake Oge. Take another hypo here. The hint book? Yeah, it's the hint book. We gotta get the hint book and then we gotta dick kick first citizen Lynette. That's a good point. Like, all I was trying to do was save my town and they give me shit for it. It's like, oh man, like you totally doomed Broken Hills. I'm like, Broken Hills can fix their own fucking problems. That's the oil rig over there, I guess. San Francisco, we have to go to New Reno, which I guess is on the way to Vault City. Pike of Death Claws, nope. Pike of Centaurs, oof. I'm just gonna go. I'll just leave. Damn it, came up just short. Just short. Gorus was hit for no damage. Are you guys done now? Can I get in my car? Thank you. Just, yep, put your robe back on. Hop in the trunk. Just like, I'm an abusive owner. Goris, we're leaving. Commercial row. And then you come here after you beat the game. At least I think it's here. I can't remember. Oh, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. I'm never drinking that much again. Okay, let's wait until sun up. Greetings, what is it? Father Tully can do for you this. You're the one that beat the Enclave like a god, dog. You're a hero. Me hero. You're a hero. I got something for you. I didn't know what it was at first, but I figure you might be needing it. Me take. Tully goes over to one of the pews, rips off a board from the seat, and pulls out a grimy soft cover book. Here you go. It's a little dirty, but... Thanks. You're a hero. You deserve it. How many gamers today finish games? But you went the distance. I'm proud of you. All of New Reno is proud of you. Thanks, Father. Bye. I'm mentally retarded because I am addicted to uh, stuff. A whole bunch of stuff. 
But anyways. Well, this would have been good to have at the beginning of the goddamn game. It's the Fallout 2 hint book. Let's use it. The book contains tons of inside information on Fallout 2, more than enough to modify yourself to the better. Gives us 300 in everything. And it gives us 10,000 experience. So you can just keep reading it if you want to get more perks. There's one last thing to do. We gotta go to Vault City, we gotta kick Lynette in the groin until she's dead. Do you want to encounter some Yakuza? No. 299% first aid? Well, can't be perfect at everything. Pack of wolves, no. Is my car gonna run out of gas? Oh, we just made it. We just made it. Don't need the super stim pack because we're just gonna kick her. Can I put the points? No, there we go. Now everything's 300%. I think it's because I was going through withdrawal or something. Yeah, just if you beat Fallout 2 and you go back there to get the book, you can just have max stats to do whatever the fuck you want. Well, skills. Like, my actual stats are in the shitter. It's Vault City, so they all fucking hide at night. Son of a bitch. Oh, we'll just go back outside. Benjamin Oge confirmed for Fallout 3 stream? Uh, no, I'm not going to do... My Fallout 3 character is only going to use um, Chinese weapons. That's going to be my Fallout 3 character. Just because like, low charisma characters aren't very interesting in the Bethesda games. We'll just wait outside. Thirty percent. Oh, did you? Did you come uh, after I read the book, Han? Is that what happened? We're gonna go kick Lynette in the dick. There you are. Piercing kick. Actually, hold on. Let's just get all tweaked out. Let's just go crazy. That's really it. That's all I have. Eh, take the jet. So you found all the books in the games? Oh no, um, if, when you beat the game, you go talk to this guy in New Reno and he gives you a book that gives you 300% in everything. That's how, that's how I managed to get 300%. Because the normal skill books, I think they stop giving you points at like 85 Anyways, I really hate Lynette, and our friend asked us to do this on Friday, so let's just kill her. That wasn't fair. Life's not fair, Lynette. Uh, 
on, Lynette, I gotta get out of here. There's nowhere to go. You ready, bitch? I don't know what Gorus is up to out there. She's fucking getting away. She's getting away with that double turn shit. Did your Deathclaw just run? No, Gorus likes to fight other dudes. Because he's so slow, he's usually behind me. So he's just over there fighting everybody else in Vault City. <laughs> Oops! Lynette was hit instead of you! Lynette was hit for 17 hit points and killed. Oh man, he's gonna get fucking fired. Oh man, what an amazing ending to the series. Oof. Let's just haymaker all these guards. Fucking knocking dudes out left and right. He hated that cunt more than me. You know, I wouldn't put that past... I don't think any... I don't think that's a crime in Vault City. I don't think killing Lynette's a crime. Like, that guy might get a medal. It's like, he actually killed her. Go back to the gym at New Reno 1 hit KO. I already beat the boxing tournament in New Reno, unfortunately. I'd be really interested to see what happened if I went there now, though. Holy shit. I was going to call him Anthony Chang, but something's smell is pretty tempting. I'm really sold on something smell now. This is this is when bloody mess would shine. This would be the perfect time to have bloody mess. <laughs> Hope you don't die too quick, miss. Whoops, fuck. So busy making fun of him, I messed up my turn. He's still alive. But anyways, this is this is the end of Fallout 2. We beat Fallout 2. And then uh, my next stream is on Wednesday, which is uh, my co-op stream, of course. I'll be playing Champions Return to Arms. And then on Friday, starting a new game, we'll be playing uh, Final Fantasy Tactics. You know, I play a lot of games. I worry that I give people the wrong message on my stream because all I've played is like Morrowind and Fallout. But I don't just play like Elder Scrolls games, Bethesda games. Play all sorts of stuff. Is it possible to rush this armor level 2 or 3? Um, if you can get to Navarro at low level, I think if, uh, if you can get to Navarro, you can get the Enclave Power Armor. So if you know exactly where it is and you can get there in one piece, then yes. He dead? Nope. He, nope. Now he's dead. What's going on over here, Gorus? What do we got? Help! I'm being killed! Help! <laughs> well, that was a very verbose description of what was happening. I think Gorus got him. Yep. Pro Consul Gregory. I think that was the guy that helped us before. Anyways, I know you're a slave, but I gotta kill everybody. He took an Enclave Power Armor 
haymaker to the back of the head. Did not take two. Yeah, there we go. We killed Lynette, which is canon. That's the canon ending. The fallout. But yeah, it's the end of the stream. There's some horrible technical issues today, but other than that, thank you for coming by, everybody. We've beaten Fallout 2. And then, like I said, our next game, we start on Friday. But that's the end of the night stream. I hope everyone has a good night or daytime or wherever the fuck you're from. But that's it for me. So until next time, goodbye.